was canceling that 5 3. And he was picking You up. know that from television. John is just saying, how do you, you time it? But so what counted down? It's just that they've started, it always looks like they're just about to start another song and then it finishes quickly when the audience starts clapping. But I didn't realize they played all the way through. But that's showmanship. I know, I know. Yeah. The whole Musicians. It survives, doesn't it, on a breed of little men who sort of like wave their yes. arms around in and the air. We down. think you're great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, you three, when I saw you last in London, there were just two. Now it's three again, thank God. How did, no, well, it's nice. Yeah. Yeah. Now, how did you all get back together? Well, he phoned me up, didn't you? Yeah, it's kind of, I mean, we were doing, uh, when they were involved with the Arcadia project, I was working on another project with Robert Palmer, right. the cool power station, and um, then, you know, we just decided it was time to get back and make Duran Duran music again. And um, the three of us were into that idea, and um, Andy wasn't. And Roger wasn't for different reasons, but uh, you know, out of something that could have been a very negative situation, we we've got some great by guys to play with now. Do you find yeah. that by being away from each other, it was wonderful because you got more energy when you came back again? Mm. It was like a yeah, oh, absolutely. I think the fact was at the time when we started Power Station Arcadio, it was we'd been doing Duran Duran for kind of five years, and we really wanted to explore something different and work with some other people because we'd only worked with each other before and uh, it was very inspiring and when we the three of us got back together and we started writing things it all fell into place very quickly now you two were childhood friends yeah hollywood birmingham were from here. smart holly hey hollywood <laughs> birmingham whoa yeah. whoa whoa i bet <laughs> and you met how well we, we you know we lived around the corner from each other we used to swap pictures of david bowie <laughs> <laughs> and how did they find you simon i was um i was at university at the time and um, these guys were in a nightclub and I heard that there was a band looking for a singer and so I made a phone call one day and I was, went down to see them at the studio at the, uh, at the nightclub and there it happened we sort of wrote our first song within the first half an hour and it was like my chance to get on stage professionally straight away I think you know we just stuck together since then you know a good thing when it happens yeah you just feel it yeah. now the three of you are all very settled down daddies and Good and solid girlfriends and all that. Who, who is the wild one when you were wild? <laughs> I think we should ask the audience. <laughs> was, it, was it you, John? Were you the big, you know, the I mean, Romeo we, of the group? We had a good, healthy, comp competitive yeah. thing going at one time, I mean, son. <laughs> yeah, and no. probably will. You know, well, not yeah. not masochism no, no, or anything like that. No, not masochism. No, 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 at no, all. no, none of that. Well, yeah. occasionally, yeah. Well. Just a twinge to keep you artistic. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> now, who who do you think of the new bands coming up? Now that you, because you're really solid in there. Now, who do you think are the new hot ones to look at? Um, I kind of like um, a group called World Party mm. that have got a record out called Ship of Fools. Is right it now. record out here now? Or? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. yeah. Go on. I I like a band called The Ver. They've been going for a long time, but. Um, uh, He's, uh, Matt Johnson's a singer. He's pretty good. Now, the three of you are going out on a seven-month tour. That's, right. That's a long tour. I mean, wh where? You get a round of applause. Yeah. You haven't yeah. played a show yeah. yet. Yeah. Where? Show where? Right. where are you going? Oh, just all over the country, or is it international? We're starting um, March 16th in Japan. Oh. Um, we've got several shows there. Uh, then we swing through Europe for about two months, and then we open in America around about June the 12th, I think, on the East Coast. And then, then we're going to be coming to your town at some point in July or August. It's about eight or ten weeks in the States. Is there any town you've been to in this country that you've just gone, unforgettable, i got to come back here? Um, yeah, New Orleans. New Orleans? New Orleans, I thought it was a yeah. really, really nice place. Here. What about you? Um, well, I suppose I could say Cleveland, but I might be lying. <laughs> Pittsburgh, actually. Uh, no. No, I actually, I, I like, uh, I like New York best, but yeah. New York. yeah. Well, when you come back, will you come back on the show? Oh, I should. Oh, I should think we could manage it. Yeah. Well, you, you can. Manage. You let us play another song. Would you do another song right yeah, now? Sure. Oh, what a joy! What a pleasure! You're going to do Skin Tray, right? Skin Tray. Thank you so much. So good to see you again. Mm.